Hello everyone, programming challenge 2, the countdown timer. This thing is a little bit like that new year countdown, where we count down to the point where we all scream happy new year, um, except it's, it's a program and you're here challenged to write it. Um, to do this you're going to need to use a, a variable, um, I think an integer would do the well. You're going to need to initialize your serial. Um, you're going to have these two serial print commands. Uh, to print a variable, you just put the name of the variable. So we could put I inside there. Or if we want to print some text, we could just put the text under quotation marks. Um, you're going to need to iterate uh, the variable, meaning change it every time the loop runs. And given that it's a countdown, like you would decrease it by one. Um, and you're going to need an if statement. Uh, basically, at some point when the number reaches zero, you want to print out a message that the countdown is complete, kind of like in this image. So let's have a look at what that's going to look like. So here it is. It's counting down one count per second. And when it gets to zero it says countdown complete and the program just stops and that's because we use serial.end that's basically going to end the transmission through the serial now if you want to you know uh, spice this up you can maybe even try to get it to count down from a number that you enter into the serial you're going to learn this in future challenges but for now that's it your turn to program it so, were you up to the challenge? If so, paste your solution code in the comments below, and if it's really simple or original, I will feature it in the solutions video. And while you're at it, why not check out some of the other challenges? So far there are six, and surely more to come.